Pelicans hosting the Pistons, and the Pelicans are seven and a half point favorites. The over under is 219. The Pistons are plus 260 on the money line, and the Pelicans are minus 320. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to tip off tomorrow, and once the lineups are confirmed, also. And if Duran is in this game, it'll probably shift the line a little bit as well. Now, thank you for everyone who has joined the Discord and who continues to join the Discord. If you've not done so yet, go to my website, rawsportstalk.com. Click on the membership tab. It is a paid membership, but it will give you access to my best bets and to my stats. The link is in my bio and in my description. The Pistons are 3-1 and one against the spread, and the over-under is 2-2 two and two in the games in which they played in. The Pelicans are 2-1 and one against the spread, and the under is 2-1. and one. Now, this is a back-to-back -back for the Pelicans, and we know what that means in the NBA. We're supposed to have Cunningham, Hayes, Thompson, Stewart, and Duran uh, is questionable. McCollum, Jones, Ingram, Williamson, and Valenueyes, or I'm going to butcher his last name every time I say it. Um, Ingram is listed as questionable. Those lineups are not confirmed. That's just what is projected. Now, head-to-head, -head, the Pelicans are on a five-game winning streak. They are 7-3 and three against the Pistons in their last 10. The favorite is 6-4 and four on the money line, while the underdog is 6-4 and four against the spread. The road team is 6-4 and four in their last 10 meetings. The under has hit in their last four. The under is 7-3, and three, and the over-under at 219 is five and five. The last two games that they played against each other, the Pelicans won 104-98 in New Orleans and 116-110 in Detroit. In the Pistons, four games, we've had a total of 210 points, 220 points, 236 points, and 211 points. They've lost their last two games and they have not covered either of those games. For the Pelicans, in their three games, we've had, wow, 183 points, 232, and then 216 points. And they've covered two out of the three of those games. I'm going to take the Pelicans with the money line. I will take the Pelicans laying the points, and I'm going to go under in this one. I understand that they've, uh, they've had a couple of close games, but the Pistons lineup is firmly on whether or not Cunningham is hot. And I've seen him get ice cold. And if he gets ice cold, this is going to be a bad game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.